everyone so I decided to bring it outside Maria's got an awesome duck out here on this cabin you can listen to the birds see a few squirrels aka tree rats so they say but um, I thought we would just listen to some birds chirping and throw some paint down on some birch boards hopefully they'll be dry before I leave on Saturday and I'll have some videos for you guys to watch while we are here and also while we're on our way home. So, I'll let you listen to it for a second and then we're going to get started. It's just beautiful. Alright, let's get to work. Hey everyone, so we have a little bit of construction going on down at the bottom of the hill, so you're going to hear a little bit of that, but we're going to do today on this 10 by 10, I think we're going to just do a dirty ribbon pour, uh, unless I change my mind when I get the cup full, but I'm only going to use one cup, so I may ring it, I'm not sure yet, I may travel it, but I want to see how it looks when I layer it. Uh, one drop of silicone in each one of my colors. I'm using the Chestnut Bronze from Paraj Posse. The Gold Rush from Paraj Posse. Our new Coral Reef Metallic, gorgeous color. And our Dark Chocolate. And I'm going to be using white. So I am going to put a little bit of white in the bottom of this cup. I am not using WD-40, so I'll put a little bit of chestnut bronze in there. We'll follow that with the coral reef. Some gold. Some dark chocolate. Definitely want this for contrast. I'll do a little bit more white. Look back at it. Actually, let's put a little bit of the Persian yellow. I'll brighten it up a little bit. This does not have silicone. And we'll go back. And we'll go the same order. This is the coral. The gold. Now I know I only need about four ounces of paint to cover this because I don't have to worry about the sides. They are taped off. But I do want to um, swirl this just a little bit. Alright guys, let's, uh, let's, let's just play. I have a lot of people that always ask me, what if you just swirled the cup around and didn't go, you know, with different cups? Just do one cup and just swirl it around. So let's try that. The what ifs of acrylic pouring. I 
hope I have enough paint on here. <laughs> I about four ounces, maybe. Okay. Let me give it a quick torch. All right, let's see what we get. Gotta move it around first. Sorry about the construction. I really thought we'd have a nice, peaceful afternoon painting out here on the deck. <laughs> and I wanted to get it in before it rains. But they'll be done soon, I'm sure. And I can get some more filming done. They're pretty far away too, but this is this is how it echoes, you know, when you're in the wilderness. I just love that coral. It's so pretty. Alright, so they're all covered. I'm going to get it moved back. spot there I'm not liking but maybe we can pull something over that let's see what happens when we torch it some nice big juicy cells there cells coming up through it. So that will be super, super shiny and metallic-y when it dries. I'm liking that one. Let me just wipe these edges off. Touch my mouse over here. So thanks so much for watching, guys. Uh, check out all the links. Shop with me on Amazon. Etsy will be back open shortly. I have it on vacation mode. Um, if it's after Tuesday, if the 26th, I'm already back open. If you want to order paint, I have all the new colors in the Etsy shop already. So uh, help yourselves. <laughs> thanks for watching. See you on the next one. Bye now.